Hey, what's going on guys? G.Casey here, bringing you a bit of a channel update. Um, my channel's been suffering lately, the past month or so, maybe two months. I've just sort of been taking a break from recording. I'm not really quite sure where I wanted to be in terms of where my interests are and things like that. I wasn't really ready to commit to anything, um, just because I was bouncing all over the place. I've been playing a lot of Dark Souls 3, playing a lot of Diablo, getting back into StarCraft, and even, and even recently I've been playing... Uh, quite a bit of League of Legends as well. So I'm kind of bouncing all over the place. I've gotten away from Final Fantasy XIV just for now. Uh, you know, I might come back to the game in the future. In fact, I feel that's probably a, a large probability because I really do like that game. But I'm just kind of getting away from MMOs right now and really sort of just playing games on my own, which has been a lot of fun. Um, and not just on my own, actually, but playing, like, I mean on my own, like, not recording them, but been playing a lot with my uh, buddy Detner and my girlfriend, um, you know, and just having a lot of fun doing that. But I've been getting that itch to come back to YouTube and, and start doing some regular uploads again. So what I've come to terms with, and this is a little bit, a little bit strange. It's it's a lot different than what I'm used to. But I have two sort of series that I've started. One of them is halfway finished recording already. Um, so I'm confident I'll be able to finish that one up. And the other one is sort of like an idea that I have that I would love to complete. And I think once I actually start uploading those videos, it'll keep me driven to keep uploading them. Um, so both of those series are going to be a playthrough of Diablo 3, Reaper of Souls, on Torment 9 difficulty with my monk that I had just been leveling up through the, the newest season that came out, season... Uh, six. I've been playing this monk, and he's he's quite strong. He can't do Torment 10, but he can do Torment 9, and it's been a lot of fun. I've already recorded over half of the game, um, so I really want to start uploading those. And the other one is going to be the entire campaign of StarCraft 2, starting from Wings of Liberty way back in the day, five, six years ago when the game came out, through Heart of the Swarm, and through Legacy of the Void. Um, on hard difficulty. I'm not good enough to do it on brutal. Okay, I'm just not good enough. I'm. It's going to be ridiculous. Um, I'm also not good enough to complete all the objectives on the map either. Like, you know, the bonus objectives that you get. Um, I just don't know what they are until after the map finished. And I don't want to go back and replay it. So I'm going to do my best, but it's not going to be a full 100% playthrough or anything like that. Um, that being said, like there's a bit of a twist with these. So, <clears throat> up until just, you know, maybe the past couple days, I've been getting really sick, and my throat has been scratchy. <clears throat> I've been getting this cold, and it just won't go away. So, I've been doing these recordings without my voice. Now, one of my buddies who I, I trust his opinion told me that, um, you know, when you don't have your voice recorded over the playthrough, it's pretty much like anybody's playing it. And as soon as he said that, it was just something I hadn't thought of. And it does, it is true. It is like anyone's playing it. You can't trust that it's me. And it, there's not quite as much personality behind it when you do have a voiceover. But I feel like these two games, um, <coughs> excuse me, are really going to benefit from no commentary because there's a lot of. Um, there's a lot of sort of story dialogue going throughout the missions and it's just it, it feels like it's gonna be like a wholesome experience if that makes any sense you know you just get the gameplay and I think it's gonna be pretty nice the video quality has turned out to be quite good and it looks nice and it sounds nice and I think it's gonna be a, a cool series so I'm gonna start uploading those and to those of you who <coughs> Excuse me, to those of you who have been around for a while, um, you know, let me know what you think about that kind of thing because I understand that it could just be anyone playing it without my voice over it. It's, um, you know, it's it, it's lacking personality, like I've already said. But I still kind of want to do it, so let me know. And if it turns out that it just like really pisses you guys off or something, then you know, maybe I won't follow through with it or I won't come up with new uh, new ideas like that in the future, but I really do kind of want to test it out and see how it goes. So that's what I'm going to be doing in the future. I'm going to be putting out Diablo videos with no commentary, StarCraft 2 campaign videos with no commentary, and 
another thing I'm going to be doing is getting back into casting StarCraft 2 Legacy of the Void multiplayer games on a little bit of a more regular basis. Um, <clears throat> I've been in, in talks with um, a fellow from CTL that you've seen me put up videos from CTL in the past. Um, <coughs> he's doing his own kind of league and he wants me to cast a lot of games for it and I've been buddies with this guy for a while and I'm happy to do it. It's going to give me some nice content, some nice games and some nice replays to be able to cast to be able to get my voice out there on the channel as well. So keep an eye out for those. Those are going to be coming shortly. I haven't received the replays yet but I should be getting them within the next few days. So I'm going to start being able to put those out on a bit more of a regular basis. So. So Diablo 2, or sorry, Diablo 3 Complete. and StarCraft 2 campaign mode will be intertwined with each other and the StarCraft 2 multiplayer casts are going to be coming out a little bit more sporadically because I have to rely on the players to get the games done. So basically whenever they're ready to go, they'll be ready to go. Anyway guys, let me know what you think about that in the comments if you feel like it. Um, and don't knock it till you see it, okay? Those, the, the episodes without commentary. Because I, I think they do have some value. Um, but I'm definitely not getting away from commentary for good. I just need to give my voice a bit of a break. Uh, you know, my job has me talking consistently all day as well. So, um, those recordings are going to be a nice break for my, my voice. Um, and the cast are going to, you know, force my voice to get back into shape as well. So, we'll see. Hopefully I don't cough too much. A, a lot of times when I talk like this on a consistent basis, it strains my throat. And it makes me either have to cough or drink something or whatever. But, uh, anyways... That's enough rambling for now. Let me know what you guys think, like I said. And uh, again, don't knock until you see it. I think it's going to look pretty nice. And I'll talk to you guys in the future. See you later.